Hi everybody, I'm Kirsty Meekin from Neo Nails. In this video, we are going to do colour blocking with glow-in-the-dark pigments, sugaring style. That's like a Wu-Tang style. <laughs> Killer bees on a swarm. Yeah. So, I'm going to... First of all, start with a coat of Snow White. So it's going to look like really pastel colour, so it's going to be lovely for summer. <laughs> Which is so far away. <laughs> so far away. I mean, like, it's the 31st of January today. I don't know when this video is going to go live, but when does summer start? 1st of May, Well, it, it could be like an Easter design. Is it 1st of May? So it's three months away. I'm is that desperate right? for summer. And I'm just going to do one coat of that because you won't necessarily see it. You just want a nice pale background. You don't have to do white. You can do any colour you want. But I think this works really nice with white. And you will need top coat for this. And you will need some glow-in-the-dark pigments. Ooh, which one shall we use? What I like a bit of orange. Oh, but maybe this one. Mm. Oh, it's so nice. But I don't know which one to use. I love them all. Maybe we'll do this. Do we like that selection? I think we're good. I like that selection of colours. We're going to use those. Is there a number you should use for colour blocking? Three. A certain number. I might actually just throw in a paler mm. colour. Three. Three. Well, if your name's Faye, you would use every single one that's in that box. Bit of backing paper from Sculpting Form. What I'm going to do is put my top coat on there. I'm going to open this one because it's not been opened. Oh my God, it's a fresh pot. Oh, no, Kirsty, don't open all the pots. Don't get excited and open the pots. Sorry, got a bit excited now. Shouldn't do that because I will just knock them everywhere. So, you want your top coat, and then you're simply going to paint on, with the top coat, your design. We're going to use geometric shapes. Can you just about see that there? There you are. Just pulling out those little bubbles that were there. And then we're going to use our powder. And we're going to tap it to sprinkle it on. I do feel like I need a sieve at this point. <laughs> Can you imagine? They want a little tiny sieve from a doll's house. Have you ever seen those mi like micro cooking videos? Yeah, I love them. <laughs> I do love them. I knew you would like that. I love that kind of stuff. Right, so just tap it to take off the excess. Some of it will stick to the sticky layer of your white. We don't worry about that because we're going to give that a bit of a wipe. And then we're going to pop that into the lamp. Lint-free pad with a bit of gel residue wipe-off solution and you're just going to clean up those edges like that. And then we're going to use this, go oh, look at that. Oh, we can put that one, we're going to do the same shape. So we're going to go next to there and then we're going to come down. And we're going to sprinkle again with this gorgeous lilac colour. Tap, 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 tap. Oh, look at that. It's so delicious. Oh, that's so nice. As you tap the nail, it kind of sieves it. It does kind of sieve it a bit if you watch that powder. It's quite satisfying, actually, to watch. Mm. 
I just want to make sure nothing's wet anymore. You want to put enough powder on to sort of take away the wetness of the top coat. Pop that in the lamp. Oh my god, that glows up green! The lilac glows up green in the dark! Dust off the excess. Just gonna give that another wipe, make sure there's no particles where we don't want them. Then we're gonna go with an, another colour. So top coat again. I love this textured look. I'm actually got, I'm not going to make that as low because I'm just going to use a gel brush to take off the excess. I just want a triangle. Somebody told me that Simon Cowell plays a triangle on every song of, um, you know, his record label. Right. So he can get... Um, the credit. Yeah. The triangle player. But I don't know if that was a load of rubbish. That, the shape of the triangle just reminded me of that little tail. So let's put the green on. Cure that. So, what colour now? I think we should use the orange. And I want to do like a little long, thin triangle. So let's do this orange. And cool. Looks like your brush. It does a bit. <laughs> Doesn't it? Right, so now I'm gonna use one colour down here and another colour down there. I'm going to do the edge first of the nail and then I'm going to move up to that edge there of the orange. Right, now we want some of the purple. Cure that. And we're going to do the last section. Ryan Little. <laughs> All right. right, so what I'm going to do now is take a toothbrush into the gel residue wipe up solution. No, not for your teeth. We're actually going to clean this up with a toothbrush. It's going to get rid of any of those particles that, that may be on there, and it's also going to clean it up. You can see that everything's immediately gone a lot brighter 
but we're going to let that dry and everything will just tone back down again. I do think it needs some crystal. Can I have a few? <laughs> Hang on, why are you making doubt like I'm not going to let you? Because you just go, oh, here we go, some more crystals. Oh, People are gonna think I'm just... like people are gonna think I'm like kind of a one of those abusive partners. <laughs> I think <laughs> just a few, just a few, just a few crystals. But I am gonna put them on with um do 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 I've seen you <laughs> here today, but I don't know where you are. Look I'm looking for the aqua jam. It's there. There, we want just a little squidge. Just a little bit of aqua jam. I think we're going to put one just, just there. That's all I want, just a little smidgen. You want to remove any excess aqua gel with a dry tool. Oh, I love that. It looks like velvet. It almost looks like velvet. Let's pop that in to the lamp. Looks like teddy bear skin. What? Care bear skin. Right. That's been cut up and put on a nail. That's quite brutal, isn't it? That? That's it's quite yeah. That's Poor kind of like, bears. Just made a patchwork quilt now. Like patchwork <laughs> bears. <laughs> you oh fur trapper. <laughs> There you are guys, if you've enjoyed that video, I'm going to show you what it looks like in the dark, obviously, because they glow in the dark pigments, so we're going to show you now. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Instagram, and everything I've used today will be listed below, as always, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Did you hit that? I don't know, I've just hit that because of my key and I've just gone. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you actually hit that there. My God.